Hey everyone, it's Kathy from OriginalWheels.com and today we're going to be talking about taking care of your wheels. So if you've ever bought wheels from us, then you know that they come looking immaculate, like new. Or maybe you already have some rims of your own. Either way, you want to take care of them, right? Stay tuned and I'll show you how. Did you know that your driving habits can make or break your wheels? Literally. Let's say you go over a pothole too fast or you go over a curb too hard. Chances are that this could crack or bend your wheel and then you'll have to replace them. So let's make sure that we do everything we can on our end to keep our wheels lasting as long as possible. So now let's talk about cleaning your wheels. If you've been keeping up with these videos, then you know that last week we talked about different wheel finishes. Cleaning your wheels doesn't just help them look nice and shiny, but it also helps protect that finish. For example, if you have chrome wheels, then you know that they pit and peel more easily, especially when they're dirty. That's why it's so important to make sure your wheels get regularly cleaned. So here with me today, as you can see, are some pretty dirty wheels. They've definitely seen some better days. Let's see if we can go ahead and get them all nice and clean. Keep in mind that the following cleaning directions are fairly general and you can actually be as detailed as you want when you're cleaning your bins. Here are a list of all the products you're going to need. A hose to rinse down your wheels, a wheel cleaner product, a wheel brush, a soft sponge with a bucket of water and soap, and some terry cloth towels. And these are both optional, but here's some polish and wax. Now we can go ahead and get started with cleaning our wheels. So the first thing you're going to want to do is rinse your wheels. Keep in mind that if you scrub while the dirt is still on there, you could scratch your wheels, so be careful. The second step is to apply a wheel cleaner. Here's the one I'm using. You can use any wheel cleaner you find. And make sure to read the back of it for directions. So the directions tell me that I'm supposed to spray at least six inches away and leave it on for 30 seconds. So I'm gonna go ahead and do that. Now, if you want to agitate the dirt even further while the wheel cleaner is still on there, you can take this wheel brush, make sure it's soft so it doesn't scratch your finish, and just start scrubbing your wheels. Once that's all set, I'm just gonna go ahead and rinse again. So as you can see, the wheel cleaner did a pretty good job of taking off all that dirt on there. But I'm just gonna go ahead and take my sponge, water, and some car wash cleaner and scrub my wheels. Now I'm just going to take a clean terry cloth towel and dry my wheels, making sure to get in between the spokes as well. These next two steps are optional. If you find that there are some impurities or some stains left on there that the previous cleanings didn't get off, you can go ahead and use a polish on there. Here I'm using this polish, but once again, you can use any polish you want. Make sure you flip it to the back to read the directions. Now the directions are telling me to take a terry cloth towel and to dab a little bit of the polish on there and then to rub it on the wheels. It says to use it sparingly. This is because the polish kind of eats away at the finish just a little bit so that way it gives it more of a shine and it gets rid of all the stains that are on there. So because of this the newly revealed finish is going to be more susceptible to dirt and scratching. Now if you did end up using polish on your wheels, make sure you coat it with a wax afterwards. This wax is going to act as a barrier between the dirt and your wheels, also making it less susceptible to scratching. done. All it took was a little bit of muscle, time, and cleaning supplies to make our wheels look great again. Once again, I'm Kathy from OriginalWheels.com and we'll see you all next week. Take care everyone.